Oh well. The chapter had all been over. I couldn't believe HBO Max was reviewing all 36 titles, including 20 originals from streaming. And I noticed why they're making a cruel buzzsaw on their programming. You know what they say? As we work towards bringing our content catalog together under one platform, we'll be making changes to the content offering available on both HBO Max and Scary Plus. But HBO Max's statement reads, this will include the removal of some content on both platforms. All I can say is, what the heck is going on with HBO Max? I noticed there's something cruel about why I warned everyone about this happening. All the animated content that we were supposed to be getting will have been never going to be happening. I noticed that 70% of everything that I saw is getting cancelled. There's something wrong about it. As I noticed that Summer Camp Islander was supposed to get an already complete final season a few weeks ago. Although it got hit with an order being delayed until next year. But a number of shows that were on Cartoon Network before migrating to HBO Max, Max have been bulked out to the content over the last few days. I know it's been pulled because these 25th but never released episodes of TV would air anyway if Julia Pot makes the difficult decision. Or I can realise what's happening to the ugly weirdness and what everyone's doing. Oh my god, they created a mass extinction of an entire programming service. Oh my god, only 30 to 40 percent of the content is gone. What the heck are they doing to each other? There's something wrong about HBO Max. There's something what I can think of. If you watched Jurassic World Dominion, there's something that felt off. Because what happened? And I noticed that HBO Max had decided to go full Jurassic World Dominion mode on creating a mass extinction of wiping out all the HBO Max IPs. What they've done to each other? This is ridiculous. I know no one really predicted it, but this has got to be one of the most darkest hours I have ever imagined in history. I don't know why Discovery Plus is doing the same thing. Their content is not what I want to see. I know everyone's migrating their way to Paramount Plus. And do you know why? Just because Paramount Plus is having Walmart involved, that should represent a sin of hope. I noticed there's no extra cost to bundle with the membership program that could save Palmer Plus. It's really good at them doing it. I noticed that why Paramount Global is acquiring Walmart, and that's good. But on the other hand, Disney Plus is doing the same thing. I noticed there's a big reason why we have to face a mass extension of everything I saw on HBO Max. But the same thing that applies to is Hulu. There's one thing why Discovery Plus and everything about HBO Max is getting diminished. I noticed whose idea was to get rid of everything. Mainly, I noticed they're bundling it with ESPN. They are on a, they're on their way to set things right. Both Pam and Disney are doing it, but Warner Brothers is taking the Kylo Ren approach. I don't know whose idea it was to do so. So, it looks like they might merge by mid 2023. But the entire world is about to think of it. Oh, man, I think I burped. So bye-bye.